Is that actually... <laughs> Giveaway. Hi everyone, and welcome back to East Park Road. So in our usual manner, we have not uploaded a video. New uploads every week is not really <laughs> what we do. Uh, but we do upload things when we've got some cool things to show. Yeah. And today is going to be one of those videos. So today, we're at Ikea. We're not actually at home, even though it looks exactly, <laughs> exactly like our dressing room. This isn't actually our dressing room. And we're finding out more about sleep and how you can sleep better. This, I mean, the store is actually legit closed. There's, on, there's only us here and maybe like some health and safety things, maybe. Yeah. So it's currently 10 p.m. So they're not focusing, but. It is 9 p.m. It's 9 p.m. It's, it's not a joke. It's <laughs> 9 p.m. The store closed at, at 5, was it? Yeah, 5. We came here earlier today for meatballs and now we're back here. And yeah, we have our own like legit. It's, it's weird because today when you walk around there's one room we kind of like the most and we always like the most and yeah. now we're sleeping in it. Which is very like, exciting. The actual room, which is very funny. So, should we do a little room tour? Should we do a house tour? We will do an IKEA house tour. We haven't done a house tour of our own house yet, but, <laughs> but we'll, we'll do this one. Is it an apartment? Is it a house? What is it? Bedroom, a dressing room and a bathroom. Yeah, the exciting. bathroom doesn't work. That, that's been... <laughs> That's it. We uh, have to use a given. different bathroom. Yeah, you cannot use that bathroom because <laughs> it would be catastrophic in that situation. But yeah, let's go in a little tour. Yeah, let's put some booking on first two cells. <laughs> Here we have our bedroom for this evening. Um, there isn't a door. I mean, it is literally just like <laughs> that's the shop <laughs> and that's the bedroom. Also, Logan's bedding we're buying it for us. Um, little dressing table, and then there's a massive walk in wardrobe which I've always obsessed over. Um, what, what's in the wardrobe? How nice it is. Um, absolutely nothing. Absolutely nothing. Oh, look, a few things. Yeah. What is that? That is a kid's jumper. Yeah. <laughs> Lovely shorts though. <laughs> not mind. Um, a display cabinet for some reason. You, yeah. you need a display cabinet in your dressing room. Yep. Yeah. Um, and then this is the bathroom. Do you have lights in your bathroom or? No lights in the bathroom. Okay, yeah. Yeah, I mean his and hers sinks, that's something we kind of wanted at home, wasn't it? Yeah, definitely. Let's have a look in the toilet. Oh, it's locked. Oh, they've actually locked it closed, so that's gonna <laughs> just cover that one off. Um, like this, this is cool. The medicine cabinet. I feel the like shower. This is just a big shopping trip for me. Sure. <laughs> uh, little shower. Is... No shower. Nope. <laughs> well, we need one then for our shower, don't we? Yeah. Yeah. And then this is more of the wardrobe with a massive mirror wall, which is great. Yeah, we like that. We do like that. I'm sure these lights will work somehow. It's probably look very dark on the cover right now, but. Is this literally our house? Because I have about 20 pairs of new heels. You do, yeah. <laughs> They've even got the same shoes. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Have them. And then, doesn't this go to like some sort of little living room thing? Yeah, so there's a little armchair in here so you can... Josh can kind of sit around while I get ready. Um. Fun fact, we actually have that armchair and that cushion at home. Different colours, different colour armchair, but we do have it. Yeah. And then in there there's more nondescript uh, IKEA. Clothing. Display only clothing, which probably won't get worn. Also, I've not actually looked in these goodie bags that we got. Wow. And I think they might be quite exciting. So we get little slippers, a little um, sleep mask, and then there's loads of stuff in here actually, which is quite nice. Oh, what? A teapot. I do like my. We do need a teapot. We do need a teapot because I really like my herbal teas at night. Um, Pillow menu, bedtime bar. Unfortunately, this is only tea and no alcohol. <laughs> <laughs> we did ask about um, alcohol, but no, there is none tonight. It's not not key to a good night's sleep, is it? Tonight, we will be finding out about the five ways you can improve your sleep. Um, so like here. Anywho, um, lovely little candle. Do you like candles? Some more coasters that we already own. Oh, we have them coasters. <laughs> I love having Literally, them. Literally, they've, they've, they've sussed the vibe completely. <laughs> they have. Um, some lovely peppermint tea. 
A little fermenty. Yeah. Nice yep. so we'll have Oh no, there's only a second one in there. Yep. And a blanket. We have that as well. <laughs> we already have, we have so that. We'll have another one. Yeah, it's our out outdoor for our. These are actually really good outdoor blankets. They are good. Oh, really good. Yeah, this is very exciting. Cool. Does the TV work? Uh, the TV does not work. It's a real no, TV. It isn't a real TV, that's just a bit of plastic. I don't think anything works. I thought it was like an old TV. What's behind the curtains? Uh, behind the curtains we've got a lovely view of... <laughs> Is that... It's, it's, it's very <laughs> snowy outside. Bad, bad weather outside. Close those curtains immediately. Nice. And that is that concludes our tour of our little house. <sighs> nice. Well done. We'll go again. There's some activities for tonight because I don't think we can just come in and go to sleep. It's so weird because it is only us in the shop. Like, there's not even staff walking around, is there? No, there's like a few just like health and safety staff. Staff. We haven't snuck in or anything. Don't sneak into IKEA. No. This was an invite only. Only event from IKEA and. Not everyone can do this. Yeah, so we're gonna have like some, some activities later to learn how to sleep, which I've been doing every day <laughs> so far, but really badly. <laughs> uh, don't sleep well, ever. Do you sleep well? You definitely sleep yeah, well. I yeah, I sleep pretty well. I don't sleep that well, so it'll be interesting to see what we can do to, to sleep better. And then tomorrow we'll probably get breakfast. Yeah, we're gonna wake up here, hopefully before cafe. people turn up, <laughs> uh, and then we can get a shower here as well. Yeah. And then no, we live about five minutes away. We can forever walk around and say we've slept in that room. Huh? Yeah. Oh. All right. Let's have a look what we can. Let's go explore. We're allowed to explore as well. Like, that's actually legit. We can go walk around and, and look around. So let's do it. Where do you want to go? I I mean I'm really like it. <laughs> When we saw this today, it doesn't even look like it's from IKEA. Is it from IKEA? Apparently it is. Yeah. That's really nice. Well, like get that on Etsy and charge 50 quid for it. Are we gonna buy it tomorrow? Or come here and spend four pounds on it. This thing's broken. You <laughs> have like a little fashion show. Bit small on the shoulders. That's nice. We can play a game where we have to go on the store and every single time so every single time we see one of our pieces of furniture we've got to take a shot. <laughs> but we end up like um, Yeah. Oh these are cute. I like these. We should get these for summer. Yeah. But now it is it is daytime outside. And there's still a snowstorm. It's still very snowy. <laughs> The windows also don't open. No. I found an iPad as well, which is good. It doesn't actually work and it's completely lying off. And there's an Xbox in here as well. That is a nice chair, isn't it? I know. Yeah. Well, how long is this joke going to go on for? I don't know. I don't, oh. <laughs> I think, do, do they do pick up one? No. You do it. You did completely, yeah. That is great. <laughs> is that, did you eat a full packet of uh, vinegar there? Yeah, yeah, just a bunch of vinegar. Got plenty of milk. Okay. <laughs> so, today we're going to tell you about the five sleep essentials recommended by IKEA for better sleep and how you can sleep better at night. So, one is light. Light. Um, dimming down the lights an hour before bed helps us transform from working life to sleepness as it calms the mind. We've got dimmable lights at home in our, in our bedroom. We do. We've got the wireless ones. That means. Yeah. Because you can control them with your phone and you can control them with Alexa or Siri or Google Home. Mm hmm Yeah, definitely. We could cut to a shot of our house now where I do, where I do it. Because okay, so I did say I would show our lights. Because I'm a nerd and kind of really like it, it's cool. So, okay Google, turn on the dressing room mirror. All right, so I'm going to show you how to 
right, turning on the dressing room mirror. Okay, Google, turn on the dressing room light. Okay, turning the dressing room on. Yep. Right, what's step number two? Step number two is noise. Don't let the bumps in the night disturb you. Find out how... <laughs> this is find out how to. <laughs> how, how do we find out how to? <laughs> uh, we'll, we're going to find out how to not let the bumps in the night d d disturb you. <laughs> I think it just means have like don't, don't have loads of noise. Something about having loads of soft furnishings around because they kind of absorb sound. You had a room with no soft furnishings in. It would all bounce around the walls like an empty room. That's actually very true because I was recording something in the kitchen earlier mm -hmm. and the noise was really echoey and then I started recording something in the living room and it was really clear. Exactly that. So the noise in the kitchen is quite echoey. Echo? Pippo, do you want a woof? Woof? Is that... And then if we go to the living room, which shows lots running up a lot of stairs, The noise is a lot clearer and crisp. And if you say echo, it doesn't echo. And if a dog barks, woof, 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 is that? It's not as bad. What's number three? Number three is temperature. When it comes to your body temperature at night, there's a science to finding the sweet spot. And I think a lot of that depends on sort of like letting air into the room before you go to bed and also a lot of people don't do this, but you should actually change your duvet between seasons. Oh, look. Because it does help, um, and you're not getting too hot in the summer and too cold in the winter. And it will just help you sleep better. And we should actually buy a summer duvet because we don't own a summer duvet. No, and we and being hot in the bed it is... And is you always get too hot in the bed. Always. Always. Um, so number four is air quality. Um, the air you breathe at night could be having a huge impact on the quality of your sleep. So as I mentioned before, opening the window, getting some fresh... <coughs> opening... Uh, I don't know what's up with my throat. Opening the window and getting fresh air in the room. Opening the window and getting fresh air in the room, going for a walk. Um, these are all great things that will actually help you sleep better. Sadly, we actually uh, can't do any of those things because um, that window doesn't open. It's not even a real window. In fact, it's just, a, a, I don't know what it is. It's just a light thing. <laughs> Step number five. If you can't get comfortable at night, or you wake up being tired, um, perhaps you should actually consider a different pillow. And everyone does need a different type of pillow. So some people might need softer pillows, some people might need flower pillows, memory foam, and so on. Ikea do have this pillow bar where you can go and have a look at different types of pillows and kind of decide which one is better for you because I know I like a good memory foam pillow. Yeah, I've got my special pillow that I've always, and always I used. Hate feather pillows because I'm allergic to them. I just want to pack. Really? Yeah, it makes my eyes really red. Um, so, comfort, light, temperature slash heat, noise, and air quality. And hopefully, if you follow all of these steps, you'll be on your way to better sleep. Benefit of sleeping in IKEA is you can just go choose a new pillow because there's hundreds of them everywhere. But this one, I'm gonna try this one. So we're in bed. We are actually in bed. Just a quick spin of the camera there. I mean, it's not the darkest of rooms to sleep in. But we do have eye masks, so that's we do, okay. We do have eye masks. It's very quiet, isn't it? Yeah. It's really quiet. We're just waiting to be brought our bedtime tea now. <laughs> and then we'll be setting off to bed. And I'm making, uh, watch something on the iPad. <laughs> Find a film. Has it got Netflix? It's frozen. No, it's frozen. It's exploding. <laughs> yeah, quick pan at all. Keep doing that. One, two, three. Should we watch some TV? TV's broken. <laughs> Damn it. It's still not working. Should we look out the window? No. I mean, just appreciate the silence.
silence. Good night. Good night. <laughs> we have to get up now. Well, where are we? <laughs> I'm so confused. Are you guys here? Joe. <laughs> yes, yeah, sadly we are, yeah. <laughs> Seriously, like, we ha you have to actually get up now. <laughs> Let's have this breakfast somewhere, so. That's good. So we are out of Ikea. We have left the I don't, I don't know how much we slept. No, no, we definitely, no, we definitely didn't sleep. Uh, we slept in Ikea. I'm going to go on like, this side, sorry. What was it called? Sleep mask, but mine snapped at one in the morning. <laughs> so I had to give Josh mine. Um, it's also really bright. It's like yeah. 8 a.m. right now. We've just had breakfast. Um, and we're leaving. But this has been a really, really good event. Yeah, and I feel like we really did good. learn about sleep. Um, and we'll outline these things when we get home. But yeah, really enjoyable. Yeah, thanks to IKEA. Thank you, IKEA Gateshead, for having us.